So you're playing Ark Ascended and you don't find any servers at the moment that interests you. Well, let me introduce you to Ark Fibercraft. Arc Fibercraft is a game mode in which one fibre can be turned into literally anything. On top of some of the most busted server rates you can find, these servers make for some short fun with no risk of losing all your stuff when you go to work. Because, well, you can just craft it again five minutes later. Welcome to Arc Fibercraft. But before we continue on with today's video, allow me to introduce you to Arc Unity, your new best friend which can show you resource spawn maps with things such as metal and silica pearls. They also have a taming calculator which shows you the most efficient way to tame something. Have every dino dossier, tribe maps for official servers, painting downloads and every command you could ever need in game. My favourite feature though is being able to see where all of your favourite dinos spawn. If you ever need any assistance on Arc, be sure to check out arcunity.com or just use my link in the description. And thank you Arc Unity for the sponsor. So, when you spawn in these types of servers, the first thing you want to do is distribute all your points. Now, the stats on these servers are usually massively boosted compared to standard Arc servers. As you can see, I have like infinite weight, I have infinite crafting skill, fortitude goes up by 50, and you're basically one punch man. But anyways, when I go on these servers, I mainly prioritize health and melee because uh, guns don't seem to do too much. It's always dinos or turrets that are killing you as turrets are usually boosted damage as well. Oh yeah, crafting pages and the engram pages come pre-unlocked on these servers as well. They also give you all the tech engrams and everything else. But once I figured out all of that, I went through and started crafting up everything with fiber. That being a smithy, a bunch of parachutes, some bowlers, and a club because uh i am the melee man and then the server went down and i would just switch to another one because there's hundreds of different fibercraft servers okay so the last server we was on just went down i can't find it anymore so we've moved over i've already got myself leveled and everything people want to know my stats there we go but um this one actually has a lot more pop in it so it's nice only downside is it's laggy as hell but um yeah we're gonna start going why does that turret have a yellow outline around it any ideas what these ones don't but that one does i i just i have no clue and there's a turret raft right there i wonder how much that's just for research purposes let's see how much turrets do i've got 5k hp can i make it to the base <clears throat> i think turrets might be boosted on this server i can't lie just minding my own business, walking through the jungle, and I come across this. People don't even build normal bases on Fibercraft servers. I just, I died. But they literally just place turrets out in the open and whack everything down. I think we should build a boat, to be honest with you. And the fact that I keep spawning west zone and it spawns me north zone is not a good sign. It means there's big bases down there. But ASA Fibercraft, it looks just as good, but it's just as, what is that, fam? That is a tiny... What? Why can I... Can I kill them? Can I just kill someone's dino somewhere? <laughs> can you imagine? Poor guy. Oh. Oh, please. Please, no. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I kind of want to give you guys a demonstration on how easy it is to, like, do stuff on these servers. So let me just get a club. Make a club. We don't have a trike BP, so we'll get a normal trike BP for now. I don't know if there's like quick healing on these servers or something that can heal them quick. What level are you? 670. All right, let's club this bad boy out. All right, and he's knocked out. Nice. Okay. I hit him a few times after. It doesn't matter. All right, then we put the berry. And he should insta tame. Nice. And now we have a 24k H well, 25k HP trike. We're just going to hop on this guy and we're going to go start soaking that boat base. Yep. Oh, wait, oh, wait, we can actually... Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Look at the HP, bro. What? <laughs> okay, turrets have got to be boosted to the, like, max on these servers. If I'm more... If I, I want to put some... Oh, I want to put a few movement speed. If I'm walking around with 273k trike off the beach, that's crazy. Is there... There's got to be healing pads, please. Yeah, there we go. It's called a medical station. Uh, can I make one in here? 
Medical. No, I probably need to make myself a smithy. Now we craft medbrews. Oh my god, medbrews take forever in this thing. What, bro? Even with crafting skill? Damn, that's awful. Okay, that is actually terrible. Once I finally got into the grooves of things, though, I really needed to get myself an industrial cooker, as we just wasn't making med brews fast enough. What are you doing? Why do I just not trust this man? I thought he's going to stab me in the back as soon as he gets the chance. I need some hide anyway, so... Wait, am I even going to be able to kill... Ow, bro. Chill. Please help. No, bro, we don't want to tame this. Ow. No, no, stop. We don't want to tame this, bro. I want to, I, want, I need, I need hide. Yes, hide. Yeah, hide. Oh, he has no gear on. Don't shoot me. Please be friend. Please be friend. <laughs> I'm trusting you. What is your name, fine sir? What is it? It is human. Okay. We call you Hugh. I generally don't have a clue what this guy's doing. But I... Hello? You good, bud? You okay? Yeah? You good? Oh, there's a friend one here. He's got a weird body. Oh my god. I... Bro, I'm, I'm getting nervous. There's too many people. A few moments later. What did I say? What did I say? What did I say, bruh? I knew it. I knew it was coming. Where are these men? Give me that spear now. Fair enough. Where are these men? Where? Go try and kill them. Dude. Dude, fam. Yeah, that's what, I that's what I thought. You take my stuff. Ah, you long leg. What you doing? Mm, mm, mm. Mm, mm. Yeah, that's what I thought. Mess with me. Give me your stuff. Mm. Yeah, let me put your gear on as well. They literally just started crafting bunk beds in my stuff, bro. What are these guys doing? <laughs> They're going to come back now. I need to put like a generator down and some actual turrets on this little box. <laughs> oh, for God's sake, man. All right, anyway, the trikes are actually kind of healed up now. It's got what? Is that 2.1 million HP? I could just by looking at it, let's see if we can soak out this base without dying. Probably not, but we'll see. Okay, never mind. I actually lasted longer when I was naked, so. Okay, so why is there a guy just flying in GCM? Oh, he's not flying in GCM. That's just a tech guy. Never mind. I don't think I'm getting my track back anytime soon. My respawn time is also just constantly going up and up. Oh god, these servers. All of that really goes to show you just can't really trust anyone on these servers or just any ARC server for the matter. But anyway, I wanted to upgrade my base and just put down some turrets on the little box I had made so I could keep crafting in peace. But little did I know, this man on a speedboat with tech turrets and heavies on it was coming right my way. Hey yo, chill, ah, bro, I can't even chill in my own little box. He just put his, he just put his boat there. For, like what? Oh, these turret rafts are the worst thing. Having someone running around with heavies and autos is awful. Is he about to blow up my stuff as well? Hey, bro, chill, please. There's nothing here. Look. Oh, poor little guy. Look, bro. Look at that. That's evil. Now, with this guy camping my stuff, it wasn't exactly a big issue, as I'd only just started, and obviously it's fibercraft. I could literally make everything over again. It was just going to be annoying to do it. So I would camp out and see if my trike could somehow soak the turrets. But it was just being melted as it wasn't hitting the front of it. Oh, that's my, that's my trike dead already. God damn. Never, never mind. And he's going to loot all my stuff as well. And I can't even get, get, get to it. But I'm just... Bro, it has nothing in it. It's lit. It's just a fabby. You can tell, bro. You've got a tech base. Leave me alone. 
But I had a plan. With the guy still raiding my base, I had the idea that if he somehow just walked away for a little bit, I could break his tech gear, bowler him, and just kill him instantly. Well, because I was basically one punch man and I had that much melee. But he was kind of playing it smart for what he was doing. So things weren't exactly going Does bro want to go away yet? Can he, can he leave? Please? Oh, I kind of want to pick up my stuff and move. Hello? <laughs> you got in a tech suit over there just breaking everything. I'm going to see if I can get a club or something and kill him. Okay. Game's just not giving me any fiber. Uh, where is it? Club. Bowlers. Just craft 10. That was so laggy, bro. Oh, he's already back here. Okay. Oh, he's tech rifle all my stuff. Nice. Hey, thanks. Thanks, guy. Yeah, real cool. Real cool. Yeah, real cool. I, I see how it is. I can't even fight him, bro. Oh, yeah. That's so nice of you. This is, this is awesome. Now, the guy would end up breaking all of my stuff and taking everything, but it didn't actually matter because not too far away, I found this guy's tech rep and all of the loot he was crafting. Uh, he owns both the boats. Oh, wow. That sucks. I thought I was going to kill him then. Well, all my stuff's gone and it's been taken already. So I think we should move on and uh, go find something else to do for the time being. Maybe build a base hidden because, uh, yeah, that didn't work. I need to turn off these clouds, bro. Oh, tech rep. Hello. Ooh. Oh, he's crafting stuff as well. Oh. Doink. Um, just hide in bush real quick. This, this guy just, um, um, wait there. Let me just hide real quick. Let me whack all this back in. Well, that's a, that's a, that's Fibercraft for you. I don't know what to say. <laughs> that's Fibercraft for you. Let's just craft the whole set. We thank you very much. I can pre-craft myself a new tech rep in here as well. On here. Yeah, might as well do that. So I don't have to go to an office. We'll craft a couple. Transmitter, maybe. What else do we need? Um, force field. Sure. We craft the element whilst we're here. Yeah, we'll get some element too. Uh, nice and uh, yeah we should be good so i would end up getting some sweet revenge on that guy i would hijack all of the stuff that he was crafting on shore as well you can't put a tech rep on your boat so this guy clearly had this all set up and ready thought he was hidden and he wasn't so i took it all started breaking everything and returned the favor to him just as he did to me but now i had taken his really good tech rifle and a really good set of tech gear I'd be sure to drop everything in the area to make sure he knew that uh, I was out to get him and his raft was next. But as I ended up leaving the base, someone else ended up trying to attack me on a PT. Now, this thing was bloody as hell and I probably could have just shot it with a tech rifle once and it would have died. But the server was just way too laggy and I, I kid you not, I couldn't fight. You can see in the video. I'm bowling random parasols and stuff and my bowlers are like five second delay. It's awful. So I ended up leaving this guy and discovering this massive base built on the side of a cliff. Now, I wouldn't be able to raid it anytime soon, but it was a good indication of the stuff to come on the server. Quite a unique base design as well, utilizing cliff plats, which obviously aren't in the game yet. And uh, like poles, I guess. Well, that fight was literally lag fest 1999, bro. Oh my god, that was awful. I'm not gonna try and fight again unless I know I could just get a bowler and then like melee them down. This gear is also awful. If you saw, I took like six turret shots and it's nearly broken already, and it's so expensive to repair. Maybe hitting a beaver dam will give me the black pearls, but oh my god. <clears throat> well. That's what happens when I voice monologues and don't pay attention to the game. I'm blaming you guys for that, not me. That's, that's your fault. Anyways, I'm going to go... Well, I guess I want to repair this tech suit. But at least we've got stuff now. Oh my god, bro. How? Oh, it's annoying. I need to go over to the snow, get a polymer. I need to go to find black pearls. I need to... Just, i got a lot to do. Apparently, these Fibercraft servers now also have tech dinos, which aren't even the game yet, which is quite fun because, you know, always being able to farm up some oil and electronics is handy. Uh, 
especially when you need thousands of them to craft a special type of gear on these servers. I was thinking about taming this baby, but to be honest, I got too lazy as the percentage just wasn't going up. I would also come across one of the more bigger bases on the server, that being Green Obelisk, which had been completely taken over, par obviously the cliffs not having turrets on them, but as we get a closer look at this thing, the base just looks kind of incredible, and it looks very annoying to raid, so I'm definitely not going to be touching that anytime soon. I mean, to be honest, this raid would take hours even for a Fibercraft server. Got a random griffin here. Someone was here literally one minute ago. Is he inside the base now? Can't see him. His team's literally been here for a minute. So he is here somewhere. I might just camp it out and see what I can find. Oh, I made a mistake. I thought I could kill that thing. Definitely not. Definitely not. That looks like a radar raft, isn't it? All those. Yeah, no, they are. I can actually push this. Literally nothing. Damn. I wonder how many people are built underwater on these maps. Because a Herbie's empty. God damn. I don't need to ever open a drop again. I got a new set of tech as well. It's not as good as uh, the crafted one, but at least there's something. The red drops give you the good good. To say the least. All of these are down, aren't they? Yeah, they are. There's Managamas here. People just left stuff here. How long has it been here for? Four hours? God damn. I didn't even know they were on this server. Can they leave anything behind for me? That'd be nice. Maybe a cryopodded Managama? Okay, see, and that is why you check. Nothing, actually. Wait, what are these? Empty cryo chambers. Okay. But I'll just take more and more, bro. Um, can I kill anything here? Maybe the RG? Nah, bro, 800 damage a hit. There's no way. This thing would last forever. I'm not even going to bother. Whilst I was venturing around the map for any raids I could possibly do, I'd come across this random Tyrandon sitting outside Ascension Cave. And then I'd head to the water and just die. Yeah, literally. I would just die as I went near Kano. It's just, there's just a naked here, bro. A douche, a douche, a douche, douche. <laughs> this place looks raidable if i can get a stego did i get a stego saddle or did i get a track no did i get a carbo set i got one carbo out of all of those drops down i can find the jenny it'll be raidable easily hmm where is it though Hmm. This is gonna be. Are they shooting? Why did they do 63k damage, bro? As if they weren't buffed enough. Please, stop. I need to find an angle and hit the Jenny. Yeah, you know what? I think we'll just go tame a Stego or something and then raid this base. Because if they have any of their breeders in the. Um, in the uh, rep, then we're all good. 
With a raid now in mind though, I'd have to grab myself a trike again as it was probably the best way to soak this base as there wasn't a ridiculous amount of turrets and the techs would be easily soakable. I set up this little box here with a rep, a healing station and everything and just prepped myself and then when I was finally ready, it was time to go. Now the trike didn't have as much HP as the last, but I would hope it could soak through all. I hope they have at least one stego cryopoded in this base. I don't even know if I'm going to be able to soak it because I do have a... Um a prim saddle i can't see any blue drops around that give me saddles so i'm kind of relying on this bad boy but uh, i don't even know we'll just see how things go it's so laggy at the moment oh my god that was delayed as like hell all right cakes a lot of hp i don't know let's see how it goes i feel like i don't really want to be on higher ground though can get shot off. Ah, is there no whips on this server? They don't have whips. Okay. Cool. I love it. Doesn't seem like it's taking a lot of damage. Okay. 5k a shot, bro. Oh my god. If these things... I've even capped turrets. I'm not making my way through this anytime soon. Holy, I need to break that Jenny ASAP. Okay, we've soaked one. Already. I'm going to change angle. And then hopefully we can soak another. Hey, move. Bro. Damn. 5k a hit. And that was 35 as well to legs. So if I don't get in the right spot, I lose a lot more. Oh, nice, another 5k spot. I can just sit here and soak this one out again as well. They don't seem to have much ammo in them, so I'll probably do this soak, then push back heal, soak again, come back heal, and then we should be good. Yeah, the, tar the turrets nearly killed me. The turrets nearly killed me. They absolutely destroyed me. No! Please don't kill him! Stop! What are you doing? Oh my god, he's gonna die, isn't he? Alright, well, I need to try it. I need to try and set up the healing pad right here. Right here, I need to set up. I need to craft one real quick. I've got med bruise on me already, so I should be able to. Oh no, please. Well, it's safe to say this is dead, and I am too. I don't think there's a world where I survive this. Well, I managed to survive. Rest in peace, my trike. Now, with the turrets doing loads of damage, I would take a different approach, as I thought the Carbon Embassy, with the good saddle, and obviously it having its shell, would be able to take as little damage as possible, and it was a good investment. Turret damage is absolutely crazy on these servers, I'm telling you. We've gone for a Carbon Embassy this time, because obviously we have the, um... Ah! Ah! Ever! Okay... What, whatever game, I guess. Can I not move bro there and you just shoot him? And it doesn't... Ow! I feel like only half the bullets are hitting. Is it being healed at the same time? I don't even know. Well, at least we can soak up... Wait, there we go. Wait, is it hitting the shell? Okay, it does 1k to the shell. Yeah, no, that's that's broken. Turtles are really good then on the this server. As you can tell, the trike and the carbo were a good combo, and we finally managed to soak nearly all of the turrets. I managed to get myself on this rock at a good angle, so I could take down the tech gen and then finally get into the base. Now for the loot. Hopefully we can get a stego or some good lines. The server is so laggy now. I don't think I can play much longer on this. I just pressed down the mouse button to shoot, and it took about three seconds for it to register. This is getting bad, bro. I think it's because the server popper is getting higher and higher at the moment. 
But that should be all the turrets down, yeah? Nice! Okay, we made it to the base at least. What? What? Hello? Is there more? Um. Okay, whatever. Oh, but they have saddles though. Do they have. Oh, I need a trike one. No, it's Stego. Trike? They have a singular trike saddle. Okay, Stego. Oh, well, there you go. We have a cryopod. It's. Damn! The 1.1k. We might be able to raid another base if we can find, like, a half decent one. A lot of element, cryopods, so many saddles. Oh, some good tech gear as well. I'm going to craft that all up, actually. While I have it. Oh, I can craft multiple pieces of it. I'll do that now. And a nice tech rifle again. Yo, we basically got all our gear back that we lost. Which is nice. Oh, nice. They have a carbon embassy blueprint as well. What's that coming out as? 151? Oh, how much? Just five difference. Ah, okay, it doesn't really matter to me. So we'll just take that one. It was good to have a saddle blueprint for that. Um, in terms of blueprints though, I don't think there's anything else we'll need. A hatchet blueprint? No, we're not going to need that. Maybe a pteranodon one. I'll take one of those regardless, for the sake of it, but yeah, nothing else is piquing my interest. Doesn't look like they have anything else here. I wonder what was shooting me then. Was it like the lag of the server and the, um, my turrets were still hitting me? Or turrets? My tech rifle shots were still hitting me. It must have been that. It's the only thing I can think of. Okay. Well, on that note, I'm running away. Because uh, it keeps lagging and I just broke all my gear somehow. Look at that. That was from myself. How did that even happen? I, I don't even know. Take this and leave. I need to grab my turtle as well, actually. Hey, are you guys going to let me take that thing? Or is it just going to have to sit there? Uh, I'm just going to have to run. No mind. Woo! Does this even have a saddle on it? Only a 25 armored one. Maybe I can try and hit a few drops and see if I can get a good one. But in terms of stats, this is so much better than what I had before. So, this is huge. Good Stego. See, told you guys. Easy. Oh my god, there's a player here. Right, I didn't even know Griffins were on this server. D on that. I can't tell if a player's on that. Is it just aggressive? What? What's going on? It seems AI tracking the way it's moving. I'm just gonna fly away, bro. You know what they say? Go broke or go home. We're gonna try and raid this base. Probably won't be able to, but if we don't, the video ends. Because this server is so laggy. Oh my god, bro. Oh, bro, I can't even... Help, please. <laughs> at this point, the server was basically capped and the ping was nearly 200 at all times. So this base would be my last chance at raiding something before I literally couldn't do it anymore. All right, our goal is just to make it to those tech grabs. If we can make it to those, I'm sure they'd have a lot of loot in those. Why is my cryo time is just stuck on zero, zero? I bet if I threw it out right now, it just wouldn't work. I bet it'd still get cryosickness. Like, it's still there. Hello? Can, can I throw it? Can we try? Instant cryosick and instant dead. <sighs> what did I say? What did I say, bro? Just... Oh, whatever, game. Whatever.